I know this looks a little weird. This is because this is my other account. This is a private account that I use occasionally on some public servers, including this one. Uh, some of you who watch this video may eventually figure out who this is. Right now, though, I'm just going to keep it the way it is. I just wanted to show you guys that there are some things I can do with building. I just haven't got that far yet. Now, this is an introduction to a recording that I did a couple of weeks ago. I have not put it together yet. Uh, I'm going to do some editing and put this at the beginning of that video. Um, the reasons are many, um, mostly because I've been rather busy. I had a little issue with the video file on one of those. It was the same time I had an issue with uh, the video file for me and my daughter. Um, it, it didn't seem to want to work at first, so I just kind of put it to the side and concentrated on other things first. Uh, this this here is a server that I, uh, I play on occasionally uh, when I can't record, but I want to do some things, and I've been on maybe more than occasionally. I've been on this quite a bit for a while. As you can see here in a minute, I'll show you around a little bit. Um, I have the chat turned off at the moment, so because the, there's no filter on it, and since I'm trying to keep this family friendly, uh, occasionally people say some things on there that would not be conducive to a family friendly video. So, anyway, sorry. Uh, <laughs> this is my castle on this server. Um, there are some cool things about this server, one of which is called jetpacks, which unfortunately are not working at the moment. So I'm going to not fly around because they're not working. Uh, you see I have a beacon, several beacons, and I've got quite a bit of cool stuff around me. So let's uh, just do a quick tour. Hello. This one. And uh, I'll show you around a little bit. Oh, one of the other things. This is a Oops, wrong side. This is an MCMMO server, so there's uh, there's some some strange things, including this lapis block thing, which is a teleport block, which is pretty cool in my opinion. Takes a little getting used to. There we go. Finally got to the bottom of my humongous towers. Uh, this is a work in progress. I do it when I have time, and I'm going to do some windows on that tower as well, so it'll look uh, pretty similar. There's another view here. Um, I'm in a taiga biome without snow. This is a 174 world, so uh, there's some cool stuff going on here, as you can see. Uh, this is a non-griefing server, so I have it set up with buttons everywhere, so there's no quick, easy way to get in here. Uh, I am pretty sparse on furniture. I guess you could call this a bachelor pad, even though I am married. My wife does not play Minecraft. <laughs> so anyway, um, this is like a throne room. Uh, oops. Unintentional teleportation. <laughs> I made this uh, this bedroom here, which is just for looks. And, uh, and, and this goes up to another level where you can get out to see things up above like the tower whoa the beacon and some other landscape uh, now it'll be a little bit laggy as I have quite a few animals in my farm so depending on where I'm standing at uh, my frames per second goes down pretty dramatically um, so right now I'm only pushing 20 20 frames per second which could make the video a little bit jumpy, I'm sorry to say. So I'll try and avoid some of that. I'll show that to you. But I've got signs up here because my daughter, KitKat303, also shares this castle with me. So uh, when I when she first moved in, uh, she had no idea how to get around. So I I uh, put some signs up so she could find her way out. Probably could take them down now. But um, at any rate, it's kind of the, you know, used to it now. I didn't prettify things up too well. Um, I'm not that great at, at interior decorating. I just kind of build the castle and stuff. Um, eventually, I'll uh, I'll get some other things going on in here to make it a little prettier. I have my brew room in here, some storage for some fancy treasures like metals and that I have as well. This is where I do the brewing. Uh, I just have two brew stands. 
This is a room full of uh, enchanted books. Some enchanted books at my shop soon. Uh, this is where I combine books and whatnot, and a uh, enchanting room over here. And this is all just storage in here. This is another reason why things are a little laggy. Is I have a lot of signs and and uh, item frames, which I probably should remove. Oh. Oh, I forgot to tell you. Also, I have, uh, with the beacon, I have speed 2, haste 2, and strength 2. So if it gets a little fast, that could cause some lag, too. So I probably should turn one of those off. So this is all just storage. Nothing pretty to see here or anything like that. I have a very basic uh, trash can deal over here that uh, the admin on the site helped me. I actually went off of his design. It's pretty simple. It's just a hopper, a dispenser, and a little bit of clocking redstone with a bit of lava underneath, so nothing fancy. Thanks Sal for that design, that was pretty easy. Um, I'll link to, he's got some videos he's putting up recently too, so maybe I'll link to his channel as well. Anyway, uh, we're going to not look at that window because I'm going to show that to you down here. Down here we have our indoor farm. <laughs> We keep it indoors, so, you know, and that's why it's laggy over that away. If you look here, you'll see I've got about 300 or so entities over that direction, 500 total around me. So it get it can get a little laggy over there. As you can see, my frames are just down to 20-ish. I have, this is the horse breeding area. It's where I breed the current horses that I have. I have another area with horses outside behind the castle. Uh, this is just where I put the horses that I'm going to breed. Keep my carrots here. This is, unfortunately, I do not know where I got this design from, but I did get it off of YouTube. Um, I did not design it myself, and it's not quite perfect. My timings are a little bit off, but to be honest with you, I just live with it, and I have not bothered to fix it. I did, however, use another, uh, uh, another brick on the fencing here instead of regular fencing or you could use, I've even tried stone fencing and that works as well. Uh, you could use any kind of stone to be honest with you, but uh, I like having the open field, the portcullis kind of look to it. But what you do is open everything up, gravel falls back down, opens up, and this is how I get my horses in. And then when you back out, back out on the other side and it falls back down. So there we go. That's the basics to the house. That's not all of it. There's more. Uh, some underground stuff way far down. I have a strip mine. There's a village with a bunch of villagers I'm working on right now. However, those are uh, not... Uh, since we haven't moved over to 1.8 yet, um, uh, that would be fun when we get over to the new snapshot. But let's see. Oh, that's too loud. Let's turn down those guys real quick. It gets too loud with all the sheepy over here and the pigs and the cows. I'll show you back around here real fast. This is where I keep my other my other horses. This is not the preferred method of entrance. I just wanted to show you guys real fast. So I've got a bunch of horses back here. They just kind of hang out in the back. Um, I don't know uh, what I'm going to do with them all. Maybe I'll sell a couple soon. And you can... Uh, you can on this server. There's a plug-in to make them into zombie or skeleton horses, and I have not done that yet. Maybe I'll show that to you when I do. There's lots of cool plugins uh, on this server. So the server, by the way, I will have a link in the description. But the server is called Crafty Carrot, and it is a PvP server, so you got to be careful. Occasionally, some there's some unwritten rules out there. Oh, I have a neighbor. There's some unwritten rules out there. Um, I don't know if they're unwritten or just implied, but uh, the idea is that you don't do you don't PvP with someone unless they agree to it. Uh, so <clears throat> if you don't do that correctly, then you could get banned. So just keep that in mind if you pop over to this server and check it out. What is this? Working progress. I see that. It's definitely a work in progress. 
That's cool. I guess they like having a view of my castle. There's a good view of it. What do you guys think? So anyway, with that, I'm going to sign off now. I'm going to turn around so you can see my castle in the background. Uh, I'm going to sign off now, and uh, right after this portion of the video, you will see some of my original uh, video from two weeks ago where I describe a little bit of what I'm doing in the single player world and then I will record shortly after that uh, this this video will come out as is and then I may show a little snippet of what's to come which will be with the new snapshot I was playing around with the snapshot and uh, something happened and I lost all my inventory I'm not sure what happened I think it's because I, I may have opened it in an older version and like all of my inventory was gone which kind of freaked me out a little bit so I I spent a little time fixing that back up so uh, I may just pop back into that and show you a little bit of what what's going on there and uh, I like the new snapshot so I wanted to move to the new snapshot because of the new the new blocks and whatnot the, the granite and the uh, what's it called? I can't remember. They end in it. The two two other stones that end in it. Uh, and oh, great rain too. Awesome. I uh, gotta love server life. <laughs> um, but anyway, the uh, the other two stones that they have, and 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 with the new villager trading and new enchantments, I wanted to switch that over before I did a lot more exploring. That's another reason why I have. Wait a little bit to record, uh, and probably too long, to be honest with you. I was waiting until I had some other things ironed out with a snapshot. And apparently I didn't wait long enough, because uh, some things got a little goofed up. So, um, I think that will do it for today. And uh, whole, I'll be right back with the footage from two weeks ago. You can watch that. And then uh, a little bit from today uh, with the new snapshot. Okay, guys. Bye-bye. Hello, everybody. Oops. I need my potato. Anyway, uh, I am back. As you can see, I'm all decked out in iron armor now. I did a little bit of background, a little bit of work uh, off camera. This little house behind me. Behind me. Uh, it's pretty crappy, but uh, it was just a basic basic little house to get me started uh, very very basic just a furnace a little bit more iron a little bit stuff in the chest not much I did find enough iron to make a full set of armor which is cool um, <clears throat> but other than that not a heck of a lot happening here let's see I can make a few arrows take with me on my adventures which I plan to do here shortly as soon as we get that done get rid of this redstone don't need all that cobble I'll keep some I have some bread I made uh, a couple extra swords <laughs> just in case um, yeah I have arrows but I don't have a bow yet uh, oh I can make a bow why didn't I make a bow? <coughs> well, that's just stupid. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, I always do that backwards. Um, there. There we go. Now I have a bow and a measly six arrows. So we can get some more done. Now I'm going to go do a little caving. Um, let's see, which direction shall we go? Okay, well, we got the uh, village that way, so I guess we'll go the other way. Oh, the other way is water. Let's check out that little hole over there, see what we got. So, uh, apologize if uh, things, uh, if it seems like I haven't been on, been doing much lately, um, but I, uh, I do have a day job. <laughs> And uh, it has been a little busy this week, so uh, not a heck of a lot of time for me to do any recording during the week. So 
I'm doing it all on the weekend and hoping hoping that I can get everything edited and put together and uploaded um, sometime early in the week here. I have both this uh, this series and the one with my daughter that I have some vi footage that we shot today. Um, that's not really a cave. Okay. But I hear zombies, so there must be some others around here somewhere. So we'll just keep walking, see what we find. So, um, I've got a few new subscribers, which is cool. I thank you very much, and I thank again the shout out from uh, Dad vs. Minecraft. Um, him and his son gave me a little shout out in their podcast, their Galactic Craft podcast. Ooh, podcast. Whoa, series. Let's play. Uh, <laughs> Shears, but I think I just need one. Oh, okay. I just need one more piece of wool, and I can make a bed one of these days. Let's check out this cave, see what we see. So, anyway, uh, Deb versus Minecraft, who gave me a shout out in his uh, series with his son. Uh, one son, uh, the other was not there this time. And uh, I appreciate that very much, and I hope that uh, maybe we can do something together one day. Um, I know that he had a server, but I haven't really been on it much. At any rate, um, also um, I plan on doing some uh, some play, uh, PvP stuff, maybe. Although I'm not good at PvP. <laughs> To say the least, I plan on perhaps so I'll get some flint. Doing uh, a little bit on the Play Minecraft server. I haven't had a chance yet. Uh, and maybe on the hive. Uh, some hide and seek. Some King of the Golden Monocle, something like that. Ooh. Nope, don't shoot me. Nah, you shot me. Alright, why don't you chase me? Chase me, I dare you. Come on, chase me. Chase me. There you go. Oh, another guy with a uh, with an enchanted bow. I don't know if I can catch him. Oh, okay. Die, die, die. Thank you. More arrows. Very nice. And there's a few in me, but I can't do anything about those. That was weird. Rather quiet zombie. Another skeleton. I love the skeletons. I don't know what it is about the skeletons. They always like to get right in my face. Right in my face. But at least they drop arrows. <laughs> so it's a lot easier to find arrows than make them, it seems. Mushroom, yeah, let's take that. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, that all sick this week too, that hasn't helped. Not helped with my recording schedule. So, uh, anyway, I would like you guys to tell me some some recommendations. What you'd like to see? What you'd like me to talk about? Uh, I know there's only ten of you <laughs> right at the moment, subscribers at least, but uh, I would still like some input. Uh, Tell me what I'm doing right. Tell me what I'm doing wrong. Tell me what you'd like to see. I don't know where he is. Okay. I know he's around here somewhere. And I was also thinking about some FTB. Um, I'm not sure I can record it. My computer barely runs FTB Horizons, the new patch that just came out recently. And, well, occasionally it crashes, but I, I got it to run, but I'm not sure if I can also record at the same time, hopefully, with the new memory that I have installed now, it'll be a little better. I have seen some improvements in FPS, but um, we'll give that a shot here shortly. I'm, I'm, I'm doing a little bit to kind of understand where I'm at. I haven't played FTB in a while, and to be honest with you, I 
I never really played it legit before, so. Uh, oh, that's interesting. Uh, so, I'm not sure how. Huh, I'm not sure how easy easy that's gonna be for me to do. Uh, because of the, the lag when I'm trying to record. Uh, but we'll see. I I can't play that one with uh, my daughter though because. Her computer can't run it for sure. I know that much. I may have to just go back the other way here. Uh, not a really good way up. Let's see what's on the other side. So, but, you know, uh, I'm not sure that she'd be that interested in FTB anyway. It's, uh, oops, I'm not sure. it, It's kind of grindy, that's for sure, and. It, it's something that would I'd have to do a lot of a lot of off camera type stuff just because it would be it would be so involved and a little bit that I have played uh, in the past has been quite involved that's for sure uh, there's a lot to it I don't know if uh, oh for anybody that doesn't know what that means FTB is feed the beast which is a a mod pack that you can download for free uh, as long as you have an account on Minecraft uh, with Mojo. Uh, okay, okay. Um, as long as you have a Minecraft account, you can download and use the Feed the Beast mod pack. And and, and this these mod packs um, have different versions. The latest one, one of the latest ones out now is uh, Horizons. It's in one six four. And uh, it includes, uh, I think, 102 mods, which is just insane. There are so many different things in, in, involved that I, I, I can't even keep them all straight. There's Ars Magica, there's, there's Applied uh, Ener Energistics or Synergistics, something like that. I'm not even sure what they are, to be honest with you. So there are so many things you can do with it. There are so many different different aspects to the game. So many different ways you can go about it. There's power. There's magic. There's different types of mobs. Um, I was playing earlier on it, and to be honest with you, I died, and I couldn't figure out how to get back to where I was because it didn't have a map. For some reason that pack didn't have a map loaded, so a mini map. So I was <laughs> completely at a loss as to how to get back to where I was. So that wasn't fun. Um, <clears throat> now, and you'll see some exciting uh, adventure and action and and uh, my let's play with my daughter this week as well. So if you haven't seen that already, I encourage you to check that one out. Uh, well, it's getting dark, so. <laughs> That must mean we've been playing for a few minutes. Oh, I'm awful close to the village, which means the zombies will be out there. Well, I know my uh, house is just a very basic uh, start. It's not very impressive. I do have some some other builder stuff that I've done that I I will show you guys on a future episode. Um, this stuff is uh, stuff I've done on a SMP server on a different account actually uh, that uh, so I, I have a separate account for, for that that server and some of the other stuff I've done in the past this is a new account so I have uh, not used this to to work those servers and these are free open servers so they're not um, okay I have that now and I have that I can make that they're they're not whitelisted servers, so it can be a little a little difficult sometimes, you know, with grief prevention and and things like that. So th their bucket server, the one I'm on, is a bucket server. Wow, I have no real good place to put down this bed, so I guess we'll just kind of plop it down here. Block off my this is my mine. Uh, what little I've done so far, I, all I really did was go down to level 11 and stopped. I haven't even gotten any diamonds yet. <coughs> I'll do I'll do some of that off camera, just uh, some grindy stuff. 
to uh, see if I can get some diamonds. And uh, eventually I'll get some, some uh, animals up here to expand the house a little bit and uh, see what we can see. But yeah, on this uh, this other server that I, I work on, I uh, have uh, kind of this huge castle built, um, but it's a bucket server, so they've got all kinds of plugins, including a jetpack, which allows you to build a lot easier sometimes uh, when, when you're not, especially in a, in a non-peaceful world. Okay, creeper, creeper. Come on, creepy creeper. Let's go. Thank you. Give me your XP. And I'll even take your gunpowder. Maybe I'll need it for brewing later on if I ever get to the nether and get myself a brew stand made. So, anyway. So I would like to see you guys uh, comment in the, in the comment section below. Let me know what you think of this series. And let me know uh, what you'd like me to do, what you'd like to see me do. I will try and get some more grindy stuff done off camera, do some more caving on camera, and uh, work toward getting toward the nether eventually here so we can we can do some more stuff. I see some peripheral stuff over there on the left. Uh, I'm going to have to go across the ocean here and see what I can find. I really would like to find another village somewhere or uh, maybe some more dungeons and see see what's out there so and uh, anyway why did that sound like I was jumping on wood that was weird okay guys this uh, may have been a little short tonight it's it's late on a Saturday night my voice is starting to go a little bit, and there's another creeper over there, over near my trees. I want to kill him before he blows up my trees. Thank you very much. I think I need to get... Do I, do I have a saddle? Oops. Dummy. I have armor, no saddle. Wow, i got to find a saddle really badly. Well, we got to get a saddle. <coughs> We get a horse and we can go riding, riding out on the plains somewhere. That'll be interesting. Uh, yeah, there's tons of I've never seen so many horses in all my life, so that's cool. So anyway, let's uh, call it a night. And you guys, please like, subscribe, and let me know what uh, you'd like. Oh, that's not good. No, don't blow up my house. I just made it. Let me know what you'd like to see, and uh, please tell your friends. Don't forget that like button. All right, guys. Good night. Wait, I forgot my signature. Potato. Good night, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.